The U.S. city of Portland has now become a battleground after federal forces cracked down heavily on Black Lives Matter protesters. Demonstrations have been held in Portland and the protesters have been protesting against racism and police brutality daily in Portland since the killing of George Floyd. But now the city has become a political theater, according to state's governor. Federal law enforcement officers have been cracking down on protesters in Portland. These arrests now come under the Trump administration's new executive order to protect U.S. monuments. A nightmarish scene has been playing out in Portland for the last two nights. Unmarked vans full of camouflaged federal agents have been pulling up next to protesters on street corners and arresting them with no explanation. Multiple videos show officers without clear identification badges using force and unmarked, unmarked vehicles to transport arrested protesters. According to the U.S. Customs and Border Protection, agents have been deployed to Portland to support a newly launched Homeland Security Department unit. This force is tasked with enforcing last month's executive order from Trump. The mayor of Portland has now asked that Trump remove the federal agents deployed in the city immediately. Now, Mayor Ted Wheeler even accused Donald Trump of using forces to further his own political agenda. Listen. Mr. President, federal agencies should never be used as your own personal army. Let's be clear, this is not political theater. This is far more dangerous than that. We have federal officers on our streets further escalating tensions and causing harm to Portlanders right now. Oregon Governor Katie Brown also called it a blatant abuse of power by federal government. She said, and I quote, the political theater from President Trump has nothing to do with public safety, unquote. 